Sorry. You're I'm okay. Sorry. Just relax. Just relax. I'm so scared. I'm sorry. You're all right. The massive evidence dumped from the Santa Fe County Sheriff's Office captured a distraught and confused Hannah Gutierrez Reed. I can't believe Alec Baldwin was holding the gun. But perhaps the most damaging information wasn't caught on camera and was instead a series of old text messages released by the sheriff given to investigators by Seth Kenny. She wanted to shoot live ammo out of the guns. Kenny, the film's ammunition supplier, told detectives before the filming of Rust on a different movie months earlier, Gutierrez Reed asked him for live ammunition, which is never allowed on any set. Savannah pressed the sheriff on the importance of those messages. Do you have an answer now as to how live ammunition got onto a movie set when it should have never been there in the first place? Uh, there was information from text messages um, that was concerning based on the fact that uh, live ammo was um, spoke about and was possibly used on a prior movie set. But that response outraged attorneys for Hannah Gutierrez Reed. In a letter to the district attorney overnight, they wrote, Sheriff Mendoza, without any evidence, implied that based on the text exchange, live rounds may have been fired on the prior set by Hannah. This was recklessly false, and there is no evidence to support this misstatement. Welcome to the worst day of my life. <laughs> As this trove of evidence became public for all, Gutierrez Reed's attorneys asked that the sheriff amend his remarks, saying Hannah has never brought live rounds on any movie set, nor has she ever fired any live rounds on any set on which she has worked, including the Rust set. This morning, the sheriff is not commenting any further, and now as the blame game plays out in public, it's the district attorney who will have the final say over any potential criminal charges. And Miguel uh, Gutierrez-Reed's lawyers were also concerned that now the focus was now on her and not on safety issues on set. That's right. They're worried that this is tainting public opinion and say it distracts from the safety report that was issued just days ago by the state. It blamed Russ management for the unsafe conditions on set and blamed them for the shooting. Hoda? All right, Miguel Almaguer on that story from the beginning. Miguel, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.